any money out of my pocket is too much money, okay? No basic song. What's up, Stitch Gang? Welcome, welcome back to another day in the Stitch Live. So, it's been a little while since I've vlogged. I did give you guys that day in the life vlog, but it's been a little while since I've done like a weekly vlog, a couple of days in my life vlog. So, we're starting this one off strong. But, of course, before we get into it, I have to bring you guys my intro. So, before we start this vlog off, before we get into the fun, be sure to leave your girl a thumbs up down below. Subscribe to join the Stitch Gang down below. Become a Stitch Gal. Become a part the gang make sure you guys also follow my socials on instagram and on tiktok at the stitch life and if you guys are on lemonade make sure you guys follow me on lemonade as well same exact handle at the stitch life so today is april 6th and as you guys can see your girl is already looking cute it's currently 257 and i just finished my work for the day well the majority of my work for the day I still have more work that I need to do, but I did already film two YouTube videos for you guys, so I'm super, super excited about that. I woke up early, did my makeup early, did my hair too. I did put my hair in two space buns, and I filmed a lot of this content for you guys. So you guys can expect to see that those videos soon, but now it's time to go play. So I'm going outside. It's currently like 74 degrees in the Bronx, which is very surprising for April, okay? It's the beginning of April at that. 75 degrees in the Bronx. And it's only April 6th. I'm here for it. Hopefully we can keep this weather up. No, tomorrow says 57. But it says it's going to be a high of 78 today. And I feel like there's just no way that I could stay in the house knowing it's so hot outside. So I'm going outside. I do have something very comfortable on. I'd say I recorded in this. But I was like, let me just complete the outfit. So I threw on my Coach Pillow Tabby and my Golden Goose sneakers. And I'll share what fragrance I'm wearing as well. So quick OOTD, Judgment Free Zone. I haven't showed you guys any of my outfits because my room just be looking crazy sometimes. And half the time, I just have clothes folded up that I need to pack away, clean clothes. And that's exactly what's happening here. And it's literally sitting right behind my mirror when I show you guys. This is a Judgment Free Zone. So I'm going to just put that out there. But let me show you guys my outfit. So this is what I'm wearing. Again, Again, a ton of clothes behind me my cardigan is coming from Target my two-piece set this set is so nice it's coming from forever 21 I have my coach pillow tabby and I also have my golden goose sneakers on like real nice real real nice forever 21 shout out to y'all so my underwear can be seen underneath it which is why I'm putting on this cardigan because I don't think that's cute but this is what I had on in the house to film so I'm just gonna leave it on I'm not gonna pick out anything else and I'm gonna try to get a quick picture today too comfy or OTD vibe and I was recording all day but I didn't put on any fragrance so I'm gonna put this one on today so this is C by Giorgio Armani this is C Fiore one of my favorite perfumes ever like if I could be a perfume that'd be one of them and I'm also gonna mix it with the Kaali Yum Gelatio Gelatio Pistachio Gelato 33 Intense so I'm gonna spray Kaali first it's my first time mixing these two not my battery dying and I don't know where my other battery is and this one edible a hundred percent edible so we're headed to Sephora because I want to return my Glossier lip balm because it's trash it's it was nice for like the first week really good consistency and now it's just an oily mess I don't like it so I'm bringing it right back and we'll see what else we get into so Um, so I've arrived to Sephora and I want to know when did European Wax Center get to co-op? Am I just late? I don't know. But I'm about to go on Sephora and make my return. I'm also going to look around, just scout some things out for the sale, even though I already, I've already, I've already curated my cart. But we're going to see the Sephora sale is coming up. So let's go. And then Five Below is right here, so I might go to Five Below too. Or in the Adidas store. I don't need anything in there, but... A Bronx native did um, help to design that store, so I kind of want to take a peek, but I don't know. But five below for sure, I think I'll go in. So let's go.
Okay, let's pop into Five Below now to see what they got. I made my exchange at Sephora. I'll show you guys what I got when I got home. When I get home, nothing crazy because the sale is coming up. Now let's go to Five Below. My budget is twenty dollars max. <laughs> I just want to know why we're bouncing balls in this store. That's all. And shooting. This is so cute, but it doesn't fit my phone. It's for the fourteen. This has Kendra's name written all over it, but I really like this flower. I already have a strawberry one, so I'm not gonna get this, but this flower might be coming home. This is so cute. I found it. How cute is this? Oh my god, I have to get this. Yeah, I know I love sharks. They have a shark one too, but it's not as cute. Oh, this sushi one is so cute too. And they have shrek, they have Reese's, Twizzlers, <gasps> SpongeBob. I feel like I should be getting this. But well, why is this mad cute and I dead don't need it, but I want it. Oh my God. How cute is this book? And you know the movie's coming out. That's so cute. Ooh. I really want Chipotle, but I have tacos at home. So I'm just gonna run into Stop and Shop real quick and get a few things to make tacos. Cause you guys know I went to Trader Joe's last, a few days ago, but I do have some ground chicken. So I'm gonna make tacos at home. So let's just get the stuff that we need. Same amount that I'm gonna spend at Chipotle, I could buy the necessary ingredients. So let's do it. Wow, I believe there's no cilantro, look at this. Yeah. 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 Okay, so checking back in. Okay, I'm on my bed, but, but I only have on the bralette. I don't have the leggings on anymore. But I want to show you guys some things. I guess we'll start with um, Sephora first. So I got the Case Skin Sun Care um, Eye Lip Balm with SPF 30. I got the original one. I think this one has the brown packaging. Let's see if I can take it out. Yes, I got this one. So it's a clear bomb. I saw it in store and it looked really good. The first one that I purchased is actually called Bad, Bad Gal Berry. I still have that one. That one is tinted. I honestly have only tried it once. And I tried it when I was six. So I didn't really get to see how it performed. But I did like it. But I did like it. Like I like the look of it. But I don't remember how nourishing and stuff it was. So I just went, went ahead and picked up the original. They're only like $14. So I feel like that's not bad. And if anything, I could go ahead and return it. But... Mm -hmm excuse me <laughs> sorry i remember myself liking how it looked on my lip but i just don't remember how nourishing they were but i went ahead and picked up another one just because i went to exchange the other thing and then ah isn't this so freaking cute this is so cute i'm not gonna lie the boot part was well, a tongue tongue no yes because it's a boot the tongue of the boot it's a little awkward in your hand because it's like, how do you, it's kind of hard. You have to kind of like hold it. Mm, it's kind of hard to hold it this way. Look, it's kind of hard. You kind of have to lay your phone down to really use it, but it's super cute. Like I couldn't leave this in the store. I also went ahead and changed my <laughs> AirPod case. This one is really cute. I did go ahead and change. I did go ahead and just add the accessory that was on my old case on my other case. not old because I'm still going to use it on this case this one i got from amazon i did go ahead and add it to this with my air tag just so i know exactly where my airpods are at at any given point but this one is really cute as well and then you can also go ahead and charge it at the bottom and then oh the flower airpod case did come with this ring so maybe i'll add it to it and just add my airpods but i don't know I just put that one on there because I couldn't be bothered to take everything off. But two things came in the mail today. The first thing are these earrings from Urban Outfitters. So I saw Shayna Renee post these on her story, on her Instagram story. And I was like, those are real cute. I did expect them to be a little bit bigger. But I'm not mad at the size of these either. They're like a medium squiggly hoop. So let's go ahead and try it on. Why not? Hold on. Oh, we like these. These are real cute. Oh, yeah. These are real, real cute. I like them, especially with this hairstyle. I feel like it's so cute. And maybe it's the look, too. The eyeshadow look and everything. 
So these retail for $17.99 or $17. I paid $5 I want to say for these. They were on sale. So I'll leave links down below. Please hold. So I'll leave links down below if they're still available. Again, I did get them from Urban Outfitters. They're so cute. I like them. There was there was another pair that I saw that were was on ASOS. Well, I saw someone buy them from ASOS. When I searched them up on ASOS, I couldn't find them. Really, really cute. They're the same exact squiggly earring hoop, but they were gold and they were a little bit bigger. And when I say I was ready to drop whatever coin for them, and I couldn't find them. So when I saw these, I was like, okay. These are cute, very similar. They're pink. My favorite color is pink. I wear a lot of pink. This will go with a lot of things too. It's just a funky earring. And I like them, so I bought them. And they were on sale. <laughs> Definitely caught me there. Next, new in the mail, is this thing right here. So it did come in a box. I already took it out the box. I was going to do a TikTok unboxing. I might still do it, but I'll show you guys what's in the package here. So it did come in a box. Let me flip the camera so y'all can see. Hold up. Don't mind the crusties. I did just finish cooking and eating. Came in the box. And then it came wrapped like this. So let's unwrap it. Shall we? They said secure. Say less. Ah. Uh, so in this package from Huda slash Kayali. If you already saw, you already saw. This It came with a sample of the water jelly. I've been wanting to try this for the longest with the Huda Beauty Full Matte, full matte Foundation. Finally got a little sample of it. I just didn't want to buy the full thing. So I got a little sample, so maybe I'll use this with the Huda Foundation. Yeah, I know that's one of my favorites. Also came with a, with a wishful <laughs> pillowgasm. What is this? This is a Cherry Glow Sleeping Mask. Never tried this. Never even heard of it, child. But I have tried the original Wishful Pineapple Enzyme Scrub. That's pretty decent. It came with this. The package came with this. And then... Come on now. Come on. You knew it was coming. You just didn't know how. Okay? You didn't know how. So I went ahead and got the 3.4 ounce of Kiali Musk. If you guys haven't already seen my Kiali collection rank me ranking my Kelly collection definitely check it out i had to get this and i heard that it might be being discontinued i don't know miss mona didn't confirm but i made sure i got my bottle in the event that it is discontinued oh, i'm not even gonna talk about this at all in this vlog just know it's good because i went ahead and got a 3.4 ounce got the big body jump so here she is you saw it first so yeah that's that this angle is chef's kiss what i'm in bed i need to go take my makeup off start to wind down a bit i have to edit tomorrow's video friday's video so i need to get to work being that i'm off tomorrow i could really chill for the night and then wake up early and start editing decisions decisions i'll see how i feel after i take my makeup off i'm not opposed to the idea of just relaxing though just saying just saying I'm trying to get my water in because y'all know I've been breaking out. It's not too bad now, but two days ago, like my forehead was going crazy, y'all. So I've been trying to get my water in. I put lemon slices in my water and then I also bought chlorophyll drops from TJ Maxx. I've had them for like a month now and I just haven't been putting it to use. But I bought chlorophyll drops, so it's chlorophyll and I believe matcha. And I just um, use the pipe and just drop one whole droplet of it into my water it doesn't taste like anything to my to me but i do have the lemons in there so maybe it's masking the taste but i have started adding chlorophyll to my water in hopes of clearing the skin even more and just you know better digestion <laughs> why did i act like i had something else to tell you i don't i'm gonna go take my makeup off and i'll catch you guys in the morning bye y'all good morning so today is Friday. Happy Friday, TGIF. I'm up. It's around 11 o'clock and I'm about to head to a cafe to get some work done. So typically after work, I don't know why the toilet is running. We need to call the plumber. But typically after work, I edit in the house. Oh, stop. What the hurt me? I edit in the house because I'm just exhausted. I want to be in my house. But being that I'm off, I'm going to go outside and, you know, get some work done outside. So, really in a cafe, but, you know, outside of my house. Outside of the normal place where I would do work. For the day, 
I wanted to smell like a floral delight today. So I went ahead with the Miss Dior Blooming Bouquet. This is a toilette, but I feel like this didn't really last as long on me in the past, but it's not too bad now. I'm also going in with the Miss Dior Eau de Parfum as well. I have the Roller Pearl. I like this, but I didn't know if I wanted to get the fragrance, like the actual perfume, because I felt like it didn't last that long on me, but I enjoyed the scent, so I got the Roller Pearl. And then, to top it all off, I went in with the Nest Turkish Rose Perfume Oil, so we smell really, really good. We smell just like the first day of spring. Floral heaven. So, yeah. That's what I have on for the day. Let me show you guys my outfit real quick. Y'all about to see the same clothes I saw yesterday. Yes, I still have not found a place to put it because I have no space for clothes. So I just see, leave clean clothes on my abdomen. It's a bad habit. But let's get into the old TV, shall we? So I look like a bag lady. But again, two-piece set is coming from Forever 21. I hid my waist beads inside. My Golden Yale Dunks. My Givenchy bag. And then I also have this bag that I got downtown. My New York City tote. So... All my carouches is in here. So let's go. today you guys saw what i put on today i don't know why i thought today was like yesterday because yesterday was 75 no wait no 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 today is nothing compared to what yesterday felt like today is 50 why does drizzling when, when, uh, oh let me hurry up and get in the supermarket because drizzling i didn't see drizzling in the forecast and i'm not prepared for rain right now 58 degrees Light rain expected to stop in 47 minutes. I need to hurry up because I just pulled up to the supermarket because I wanted to get some things to make a pizza this weekend. If not this weekend on Monday. We'll see. But I bought pizza dough from Trader Joe's because I've heard a lot of good things about it. Excuse me. But I don't have anything to make the pizza. So I really want to probably get some... Ooh, excuse me. I want to get some basil. Fresh basil probably. I want to get some fresh mozzarella. And I want to get some turkey pepperoni. I saw some at the supermarket I went to yesterday to make my tacos, which were really good, by the way. But 
I don't like the boar's head. Uh, I don't want the boar's head pepperoni because that has BHAs and some other stuff, nitrates and all that stuff. I don't want that in the pepperoni. Uh, so I really like this other brand that's organic that's sold at the shop, right? So I'm gonna run in real quick before it rains. I don't think I need anything else in there. So I don't know, we'll see. But shout out to your girl because she finished editing today's video. I really like going to cafes or just leaving my house to edit because I feel like I'm so much more focused outside of my house. Because at home, I decide to go in the kitchen to get a snack. I decide to switch channels on TV. I'm doing everything but editing, child. I have nothing to do at this cafe except for my work. So we did good. Um, I did stay a little over the time that I told you guys I would. I saw like three police cars pass by and I was just like, please don't look at my car. Please don't look at my car. Please don't look at my car. And they weren't traffic police, so I was fine. But I did stay till around 2.30. It's 2.56 now. And I'm about to run in the store and come back out. These decale from Mexico drinks are so good. I should get another mango chili. Hmm. When there is literally one left, it was waiting for me. What? Thank you kindly. Ugh. One left. Right time, perfect place. Oh, don't this look so good? And I'm getting these, I have to get these. I love all my raisin cookies and they're small ones, portion control. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna eat the whole container. How cute are these? It's Good Friday, so they have some Easter pops. These are so cute. Oh my God. Now what? These are so cute. Now, I don't know why I would buy basil for $6.99 you know those packs that they come in why would I buy for $6.99 when I could get a whole plant for $2.99 now make it make sense your girl bought a whole plant a whole basil plant usually oh we plant basil in the garden it's about to be that time my OG triple S G's y'all already know how we give it up in my crib we plant a lot at the crib but it's still a little cold i was breezing to the car because i'm like it's cold out here i don't know why i thought it was warm out here but i got the basil plant i got everything i needed plus some cookies that i didn't really need but i love oatmeal raisin cookies i haven't had that in a while this k k skin lip balm you need to add it to your car i'm so mad because Sorry, my camera flipped. I'm just now putting up, well, I'm about to put up my Sephora recommendation slash wish list video. Today, Friday, you guys are going to be seeing this on Sunday. And, I mean, the sale wouldn't have commenced as yet, but it's not in that video. So, I feel like I'm probably going to get a new, a lot of new comers to my channel on that video. And they might not see this vlog, but listen, if you already watched that one, add this to your cart. This case skin lip balm is so good. Yeah, I need to get it. You heard it here first. That is fire, okay? Please don't deny me. You ain't getting your bitch back. All right, gas is the card. Spent already too much money today. So let's go. I didn't really spend that much, but like any money out of my pocket is too much money. Okay. <laughs> hey, y'all. I'm in Marshall's. It's Saturday. I just found this jacket. How cute is this? I think I'm going to get it. It's $29, I think. And it's from the brand Bagatelle. So yeah, this is my OTD beat, by the way. I'm wearing this with my Gucci pouch that, you yeah, know, I put a strap on to make it a crossbody. But I'm gonna get this jacket, it's cute. Okay, Bottega dupe. Y'all cannot tell me this don't look like Bottega. Genuine leather, made in Italy. The brand is, I can't even read it. The brand is 
Zarapel, $56, y'all. This is Fuego. We got the honey pear. So I'm in Jackson Heights and I made my way into this Islamic store and they have a ton of fragrances. I want to see some of them. This looks interesting. Concentrated perfume. You know they perfumes gonna be loud and last. Karina Rose. Oh, this oud look good. That's what I have so far. They have a ton of stuff in here, y'all. And each rollerball is three, and the fragrance, the spray is six. Y'all see the sky? Oh my God. Hey y'all, chicken in. Who is this that texts me? Ooh. I'm drinking my chlorophyll water and I have a little bit of lemon, lime juice, lemon juice in here as well. Come on. I'm about to do a whole haul. Let's not do that. Oh, I need some lotion before I do anything. Okay. So I'm back from Jackson Heights. I don't even think you guys even knew where I went, to be honest. I just brought the camera with me. Didn't really know where we were going to end up. My cousin was in the city or in the Bronx. So we just decided to go on the road. So we went to TJ Maxx first. And I bought two things, three things. So the first thing that I bought was that jacket that I showed you guys in store that was $29.99 cute little trench parka for the Spring so I got that I feel like we're a little zoomed in we zoom out a little bit So I got that I also got these pants that have been super super trendy I've been seeing them at Zara. I actually tried on a pair at Zara, but they were like $69 and I'm like absolutely not I didn't I saw a pair on Amazon but they were men so I was kind of confused about the sizing and then I saw these in the store today and they were 16 I think $16.99 I didn't even try them on I just bought them so I'll go ahead and start the video so you guys can see it here and then I also got these clips these no crease clips because I am planning to install a wig probably sometime this week and I feel like I might need these and they're Barbie this is super cute. I could have just gotten some from 7 a.m. But I probably wouldn't get them in time for me to install the wig. Because I know I'm probably going to have it straight and I need to lay it down. So, or that's what I think I need to do. <laughs> so, yeah, I got that. And then, oh, these were $5.99. Mm, I was like, that's kind of expensive. But maybe because they're Barbie. And then, we went to Jackson Heights. And I really wanted to get some hair stuff because on tiktok i've been seeing that the way to grow your hair is to get some of these products and my hair is growing but i feel like my edges could be a little better so i went i wanted to pick up the alma oil and this birding ranch oil i think that's what it's called i had both of them in my amazon cart but i just figured it'd be cheaper to buy it in store so i wouldn't have to pay for shipping and it's probably going to be cheaper at like a um asian 
store like an Indian store a Bengali store something like that so I did find some in a Bengali store in Jackson Heights so let me show you guys what I picked up today so the first thing was this alma oil this one actually my mom actually randomly bought in the Bronx this morning and it was just so crazy because we ended up going to Jackson Heights and I was gonna get it there but she found one in the Bronx and this one was $6.99 but in Jackson Heights it was cheaper it was like a dollar cheaper so I recommend going to this store I think she found this in like a regular hair store and then we also got this this is the Mahat Bering Garage oil I think it's just called Bering Garage oil but the authentic name or the real name is Mahat Mahat Bering Garage don't kill me sorry oil hopefully I'm pronouncing it right scalp massage oil so I'm gonna mix up mix up a few things if you guys I'll probably feature that in the next vlog I'll show you guys what I use and then we'll see if it works for me um, but I do have a little recipe that I want to put together concoct and we're gonna see how it works and then I also found a ton of fragrances and just FYI the bidding garage oil bidding garage oil was $11.99 there were a few different ones, but I went with the ones that they recommended in the store. She said she uses it. I trust her wholeheartedly. So I also found a few different fragrances. There was a Islamic store in that area and they were selling fragrance oils. And I wanted to pop in, you know, I had to go see what they had. So I bought four different fragrances today, three perfume oils and one spray. The oils were three dollars and the spray was six. So let me go through each one. Okay. The first one, they're all coming from Crown Perfumes. The first one is White Musk. Yeah, I know I love me a musk. I just got a Kaali musk, full size. This smells so good. This was the first one I was like, yeah, you could go ahead and put that little in a little basket. Hopefully you could see it. It smells so good. The epitome of musk. Your skin but better. I love it. I'm taking them out of the box right away too. The next one that I got was this one. I actually had to go back for it. Because I smelled it on my body hours later. And I was like, oh yeah, I put that one back. Let me go back and get it. And these were only three dollars. So this one is called the Red Rose. Red Rose. This smells so good. Definitely floral, definitely giving you rose. It's a little sweet, not too much, but I feel like perfect for spring. And the last one that I got was Oud Rose. I feel like I could wear this one now, maybe in the nighttime. But this would be perfect for the, oh, I didn't show you the box, I'm sorry. This one would be perfect for the warmer months, but I feel like I could get away with it in the summer and spring too as long as I wear it in the nighttime. Oh this is good. This is good. Definitely get the warmth from the wood and then the floral notes from the rose. And then the last one that I got was this one, Sabaya. This one caught me like right away. The sprays are six dollars. So I got this one too. I feel like this bottle is leaking though. I don't like that. It's ready on my hand because I did spray it earlier. Yeah, this one is nice too. This one is florally kind of sweet, a bit clean. This is what the bottle looks like. Don't know where I'm gonna put these cause you know I don't have no space. Don't know where I'm gonna put these. I didn't even open this. I'm gonna just open it cause at this point, might as well. My nail broke. I'm not giving y'all a finger, I promise. I showed you guys this earlier on in the vlog. Okay, ASMR. I'm excited. Oh, now I can spray this freely because my mini one, I be having to use it sparingly. This is the one, I love this stuff right here. And then I did get a package from Amazon. Where are those? At? Oh, I did order razor cartridges or refill cartridges, but those are not coming till tomorrow. But I did go ahead and re-up on this thing right here. So I initially tried this 
through in, through influencer they sent this over for me to review in addition to the dark spot serum i didn't read up on the dark spot serum but i will be only because i have a few other serums that are um, prone to that are for targeting dark spots and i haven't been using them so i said i'm gonna wait i'm gonna use what i have before i read up but this moisturizer right here is so good do the most sheer moisturizer with spf 30. it is sold in target but i have to order it online because it's not in store at any of my targets i love this stuff and i love the fact that it already has spf in it it has spf 30 could have been higher but hell i take it because i could skip a step when applying my my um skincare in the morning because it's already in the formula this is from mel the science of melanin rich skin honestly my tatcha just finished i'm using the honey halo that i got for my birthday i do really like this from pharmacy but like i still have to apply spf after this has spf already this is the bomb.com so i just went ahead and picked that up and i realized it's cheaper on amazon than it is on target sites so what did i do i got it on amazon and target takes forever to ship so i just it was just a win for me to purchase it on amazon i would get it i got it in a day and it was cheaper like target i gotta i gotta do better and that is it i might be going outside again i don't know let's see it's thursday friday saturday no three day vlog this is a three day vlog before i end the vlog i, I do have some clips from march from a saint patrick's day i think from saint patrick's day and maybe another day so make sure you guys stay till after the outro because i do have some extra clips that i want to just pop in just so that doesn't go to waste but i'm going to end it off here so i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog definitely expect to see a longer vlog next sunday because i'm home all weekend i'll be vlogging from sunday all the way to next saturday so definitely stay tuned for next sunday's vlog but i hope you guys enjoyed this week's vlog anything that i mentioned today i will try to find links and per usual i'll have, I'll have everything linked down below for you guys if you guys enjoyed today's video don't head out before leaving your girl a thumbs up down below share this video with one of your friends subscribe down below as well I had to make sure both my fingers with my nails are on. Subscribe down below as well and follow me on Instagram and on TikTok at The Stitch Life and on Lemon 8. Lemon 8 is a new app. It's like a mix between Pinterest, Instagram, and TikTok. I've been really liking it. Follow me on Lemon 8, same handle at The Stitch Life. Drop a comment down below. Let me know if you guys have tried any of the products that I picked up today. And until the next video, which will be on Wednesday, I'll see you guys all later. Bye, guys. <laughs>